That was a uh, that was an intense cut. Feels like the game is really picking up. <laughs> Feels like we're at the point of no return for for our character. Uh, all right, we're in a flashback now. Mirko looks like sandals here. That's interesting. I can't go further. Scared to wet your pants? Nah, if I were alone. How about this? If I get to the other side without wetting my skirt, you'll teach me to play the flute. They mean literally getting my, my pants wet. Oh boy, here we go again. All right, and if you do it wet, will you kiss me? Not a chance. What are you thinking? Well, you're sure of your success, aren't you? If you reach the other side, I'll make another flute just for you. Deal. Oh no. Oh. There we go. Oh no. There we go. Oh, oops. Right, up, right, right, up. Right, right, right. Okay, no. <clears throat> So close. One. No. Nope. Oh, oops. There we go. This is a fun puzzle part. Nope. I get it. I get it. Nope. I, I keep forgetting movement is like actually tile based here and rhythm based. He pushed us in and then he jumped in himself and now we're going to make out. And if thy right hand offend thee, cut it off and cast it from thee. Not in the slightest. 
This is not that bad. Please be still. Be quiet, please. Please. Not, not that bad, huh? Will it go back? Why not? It's not like it's harder for God to work one miracle than... A miracle? You didn't... You didn't believe in it. From the start, you were angry that a miracle could happen to me. No. To, to, to a person like me. No. I'm so, so dumb and jealous. Give me an injection. There's none left. All this, this time, this, this wasn't just empty talk. I know. All this f philosophy. Ah, rejoice, God. God doesn't talk to me anymore since I met you. No, leave me. I'll be on, on my own. I'm Don't sorry. touch me. It's a bummer. She saved his life, but... Oh, and he lost his cup. Sixteen oh five. I can't take out my thing yet. My my lantern. For the first time since meeting Ilya, Indica felt a stab of doubt. What if she had made a mistake? What if she had done something wrong? What if the Kudyets wouldn't work? Why was every step on her road to God drawing her closer to the devil? I did everything correctly. Otherwise he would have died from sepsis. And if he didn't? There! He's healed! A miracle! Wouldn't feel good, would it? That means he was indeed talking to God and earned his absolution. God, please. Talk to me this one time. How did I go against you? Is it in my power to intervene in your design? Is this a part of your plan? Is this how it's supposed to be? She's talking into the cup. You will be all right. The arm will heal. Ilya will live. He'll live. Are healing and living the same so thing? So now I have to feel guilt for this as well? You can see I'm trying, but he's always behind my shoulder. Me again. You were driven by fear, the fear of ending up with a corpse. And back then, with the gypsy, what was it? Were you restless because of his tanned arms? Oh, Mirko. Okay. <laughs> A circuitous path and we have to choose one of the doors. It doesn't matter, they're both the same, but the choice that we make means something. We took the left hand path. They both lead to the same location. Oop. Can I climb up? Yep. What does this do for us? Nothing there.
There we go. That should be okay, right? going what is the goal here oh there's another board right there duh how are these secured are they secured doesn't seem like it Can't go down there. What is here? What is what does this do for us? Where does this bring us? Can't get up there. So that's pointless. Where am I going? Is it right here we want to go to? Yes, I see. Okay. Okay. Oh, I get it. Okay. And now we make this go up. Do that. Climb onto this. Now we can climb up here. And... Right here. What a pity. <laughs> All right, well. The temple of John of Damascus, the one from the poster, was towering over Indica. She was consumed by anxiety more and more. What if she was late? What if they realized who she was and wouldn't let her in? What if she was not worthy of a miracle? Maybe one needed to buy a ticket to see the miracle, and all the tickets had sold out. What if her certainty in God's plan was just another delusion, a temptation she so faint-heartedly succumbed to? Fish? Look at how much fish she just threw out. Or whatever the heck this is. Slime. We avoided getting slimed by the weird old lady. Hmm. Okay, oh, we tried it and it just doesn't work. Got it.
can't. I should go down just to do it. The life of Saint Yona, Jonah. In his first years as a monk, the recluse of Saint Jonah lived with Opetatis, a shrewd old woman known for tempting his brothers and trying their patience. Jonah was no exception. In the morning, Optatis would hide under a bench and jump at him, screaming. In the refectory, he would yell and hurl dead flies and soot from the furnace into Jonah's food. When Jonah was praying, Optatis would shriek and slap the prayer book from his hands. And before going to bed, Optatus would scream and hit Jonah in the stomach with a hot firebrand. Accordion. What is that guy up to? He's dancing to nothing. That's very strange and Lynchian as well. What is going on with this game? <laughs> Samovar, Last Supper, huh? How corny. I, I watched a video about Samovar. They're like outdoor tea brewing pots, basically that are like culturally valuable in Russia or like culturally significant. I actually know very little about them, but they seem interesting. I can't really drink tea because it makes me nauseous. The tannins in it make me very nauseated. <gasps> Ilya! Give it back! Have you read it? What happened to your hair? Huh. What's back here? Paraskieva Friday, Holy Martyr Paraskieva, pray to God for us. <gasps> Every time you get points, you gain an extra eight. Shame eight. <laughs> That's brutal. We'll go for the long con. You don't like it? That the prioress cut it as punishment? It wasn't a big deal. I burned Father Sergei's Felonian. His hand moves on its own. It waves to you. There is a way that seems straight to a man, but its end is the way to death. Proverbs 14, 12. Pretty. Weird looking fire. Let's go, Ilya. Come on. Where is he going, dude? What is happening? <laughs> what is happening in the world of this game? How are we... How are we gonna get down? Why... Why is the world all messed up? Makes sense.
the rooms are all wacky. We're really losing it. What do we keep seeing there? It's a big old body. What is happening? Oh God, what is that? It was us that we're seeing. Look at that. Why are we a terrifying monster? What does it mean? Chat, what does it mean? Put your theory in the YouTube comment below. Oh, it needs to go right here so I can walk over there, maybe? I don't know. We'll try this. Um... I don't know where it needs to go. Hold on. Where do we need it to be? I don't know what my goal in this room is. It's not up there. Is it meant to be right here? Is that it? Oh fuck, I walked into the hole. <clears throat> oh well. I, I just don't know where the exit is supposed to be. My guess is up there, right? But like how, how does that work? How do we get up there? That's way up there. That's unusable. I would need... So this is the wall. It can't be there. Is there another configuration of the room? I guess I can look. Can't really look. Is it just here? Do I do this? And then run back. And it's like, no. How in the world? There is Ilya. Is it just like this? No, it can't be. What is that? How do we get over there? Uh, that's right there. I, I don't know. I don't know what to do. This is like the exact kind of thinking I'm very bad at.
I see, maybe. Do I have to do like this? And now you should be able to maybe climb. No? So I was thinking maybe I could get up there. But then that strands me up there. Where the heck do I need to go? Um, come on. Where am I headed? Is it this? Is that what I want? No. Is it this? This is like truly spatial puzzles like this can go to hell. <laughs> like truly. This is evil. I am very bad at these. I don't even, I can't even tell where I'm supposed to be going. That's the problem. So this is up against the wall, which does bring us right here. But now we just have this useless thing that we can't actually use to get anywhere because it's not where it needs to freaking be. We clearly need to be able to get over to the room Ilya was in. I see. I think I get it. I think I get it now. We have to push it so that it blocks this way and then drop down so that we don't, we can actually stand on it. That's why it's white right there so that we do this. Beep. Okay, now we're good. Now we're closer to getting to where we need to be. I understand a little bit better now. Okay, we have navigated the dream space. I'm walking. Oh, you've got to be kidding. There we go. And I couldn't pick up the book because I didn't know where I was in relation to it in the map. Got it. Unless... Oh, there was no way to get it, I don't think. Unless it's right here. I got it. Oh, it's not a book. St. Nicholas. Our Holy Father Nicholas, pray to our Lord Jesus Christ for the salvation of our soul. Neat. Look, that's our cathedral from the poster. He probably feels terrible. I hate his fingers just being lax and open like that. Ugh. Wait, this is Karl Marx. Why are we praying in front of Karl Marx? Oh no, communism, the agenda, the communist agenda has corrupted our, our nun and I'm not getting devotion for it. Oh no. That's his. What? The tavern you were talking about. 
There it is, below. Yeah. By the way, see the pawn shop opposite the tavern? Its owner is Naam Bat, Ephraim's brother. They've always hated each other, and yet depended on each other. Hmm. Naam was buying stolen stuff from the vagrants, who would then go to Ephraim to spend the money on shitty wine and whores. And Ephraim's spoons would often end up in Naam's shop. We used to call them the Batshit Brothers. Why don't they like each other? Because each of them thinks that the other brother is richer. Soon you'll be able to play a concert there again. I want to see it, yes? She's gonna give up the nun life to live in the big city. His hand is so spooky. Was that the hand we saw over our shoulder when we were hiding in the bathroom? Let's go down. Let's explore what's down there. Just do it to do it, why not? All right, there's no real reason it doesn't do anything. It's just interactable to be interactable. That's kind of weird. What is with the scale in this game? It's so unreal. Shit, it's not finished. It's like we're little toy people. Just the buildings in general are massive. Down! <laughs> Up! Get down! What is happening? Stop yelling. I'm coming down. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where Fucking silly girl. Shut up, man. What are you doing? Get down from me, you fucking bitch. What the fuck are you doing? Where are you going? I'm coming down. I'm coming down. I'm coming down. Why are you shouting still? What are you doing? Huh? Oh, I see. And now we, we put it over here so that he can walk. I'm yelling, I'm, I'm, I'm coming down. What, are you doing? what do you think I'm doing? I'm coming down. Oh no, it's too small. Don't fucking talk to me. What are you doing? We're gonna have to kill him, I think. Fucking 
I'm confused. Also, the characters yelling is is getting extremely irritating. I get it. I get what I'm supposed to do. I get what I'm supposed to do. So we take this and we rotate it and put it down so that it, it, it is in the middle and can boost up the other one. So we do this. Put it down that way. And now we do this. And we good. Why are you shouting still? Ah! <clears throat> and now we should be able to walk across. Fuck those guys, though. All my homies hate those guys. Bloop. All right. Wait, can we do that? 